Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's video is going to be the introduction of my summer Project Use It Up. So if you guys have never heard of a Project Use It Up before, it's basically where you focus on using up a bunch of your body care products. I like to theme mine around um, each season. So this one is like specifically summer themed. I will let you guys know I don't really enjoy tropical scents and I don't really enjoy uh, floral scents. So that kind of is reflected in here. I love gourmand. I love fruity. Um, so that's kind of what's going on here. And I decided to not include hand soaps in this summer project just because it's kind of a hassle, not going to be, not going to lie, uh, to take it all out of the bathroom downstairs and bring it up here. I feel like we've been going through hand soaps at a good pace that I don't really need to monitor, um, that with the project use it up but I will go ahead and get into the body care. So if you guys saw my spring Project Use It Up finale, you'll know that I did actually have Pink Velvet Cupcake in that one too. And I am gonna keep it in in both the spray and the shower gel just because I'm pretty much almost done with them. Um, I'm gonna mark the spray. I've actually been using it in like the two week off period that I've been, uh, that I gave myself between uh, the spring project and the summer project. Um, I've still been using them, so they're pretty much almost completed. I really hope they bring out pink, pink Velvet Cupcake again for the fall time, um, but I don't know. Some people seem to think that they're not going to bring it out again because they brought it out for two years in a row. I hope that's a lie though because I really like this scent. The scent notes are sparkling red berries, whipped pink marshmallow, and sugared praline. So I am, and don't mind the scratch mark, I just use like scissors to try and scratch off the packaging so I can see where I'm at, but I'm about right here, which is like a third of the way through. Um, so far I've been using it for one, two, three, four, five, six months. Um, and if I keep using it at this pace, hopefully I can have it done in the next few months. I'm really hoping to finish this off and have a full size body mist out of my collection. And then the shower gel, I'm pretty much almost done with this as well. I'm about here a little under halfway and really love this in the shower. It's just like nice and sugary sweet. It smells amazing with a little bit of berries in there. So just gonna try and finish this one up. I'm hoping uh, by the end of the month, maybe, we'll see. And then another thing I'm keeping in is Almond Blossom. I actually just really enjoy this scent, especially for like date nights or something. Um, it's just like nice and sophisticated without being too floral because like I said, guys, I'm not a floral person, but this one is like a soft floral with a little bit of musk and that's why I really like it for the musk but Almond Blossom is gonna be staying in for the summer project. This is where I'm at right now. Um, compared to last month, I used up a little bit um, in the past like two weeks. So that's been good. And then the last thing that I'm gonna carry over from the spring is Bonfire Bash in the lotion. And I'll just go ahead and mark where I'm at with that right now. Um, the scent notes on this are vanilla bourbon, creamy sandalwood, and cashmere musk. I do love me a good musk, um, but this is Bonfire Bash. If you can tell, it's like a little discolored, so I just wanted to get this finished up. It's from last fall. Um, I wanna get it finished up before this fall, so that way it's not gonna go bad on me. But we are right here with it. I've used this much in the past like two weeks, so I think it, I've been doing really good progress with this one. It smells amazing, just smells like marshmallows. It smells so good at nighttime, it's like really relaxing. So this is a good one that I think I can get finished up relatively quickly. And um, so that's everything that I'm carrying over. Now for new stuff. The first new thing I'm gonna put in is coconut cream pie and the body cream. Oh, it smells delicious. The scent notes are toasted coconut flakes, caramel custard, and golden pie crust. It smells so good. Definitely has a lot of caramel to it. So if you don't enjoy caramel, you probably won't like this, but I did measure it and it measured out at 6.9 ounces. I just uh, measured this on my mom's like weighing scale that you weigh for like packages um that's what i measured this on uh it's, it's supposed to be like eight ounces when you first get it so i've been using it already so it's down to about seven ounces so i think i can get through this pretty quickly as well it smells so delicious though and i'm usually not a coconut person but i've really been loving this one so there's something about it i think it's just because it's so hot here though and then another new item i'll be putting in is the blackberry and basil 
shower gel. This smells amazing. I've been using it for the past couple of weeks while I was on like a break from the Project Use It Ups. So it is already a little bit used. Um, the scent notes are fresh blackberry, pink pomelo, sweet basil, and jasmine petals. I just figured out recently that I actually really love the scent of jasmine. So yeah, this smells amazing. It's very fresh with like that hint of uh, mint with like a little bit of, it's like a little green. You know when people say things smell like grass? This almost has a little bit of grass to it, which kind of makes it the perfect scent for summer in my opinion. Um, it's like really fresh and I've been using it like after I'll work out or something or be outside a lot um, and it smells amazing. So this is a really good one. I'm really excited to start using it and like continue to use it up um, because it's like, it's really, really good. I've, I'm very surprised. I don't think I've had anything in blackberries and basil in body care yet, but I have had it in like the hand soap before and I really loved it. So. That I think I got at Winter SAS for 75% off. So that was a really good deal. Excited to use that. And then I have some minis because I will be doing some traveling um, late June, early July, and then like halfway through July. So I have a few minis in here. I have Bali Black Coconut Sands in the shower gel. And this is from last year. I brought it on vacation with me last year and used up about half of it. So it's already marked right here. It just smells like coconut to be honest with you. It smells really, really good though. So I'm excited to bring this on a trip and just like use this. It smells amazing. And then I'm also gonna put in Sunset Glow in the shower gel. Um, the scent notes are fresh coconut, sparkling cherry seltzer, dreamy moonflower, and caramelized vanilla. I haven't really used this yet and they're already like retiring it. So I kind of want to use it and see how I feel about it if I want to get like a full size before SAS is over. But so far it just smells summary um i don't really smell any coconut on cold but maybe in the shower i will but um it's completely unused i just got it a few months ago so i'm gonna start using this one up and then i have the body cream in belize tropical cabana it literally smells like banana candy um it's it's pretty much unused i've used it maybe two times but it smells really 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 like summer so i feel like this is like the perfect time to use it because i can't imagine it using it any other time um so i'm hoping to finish this one up soon um, but that's it for mini body care and then the hand lotions i always put in a few hand lotions in this project because i am obsessed with the bath and body works hand lotion formula i actually just put some on like a few minutes ago um before i filmed but the first one i'm going to put in the project is snowy peach berry this is from the fall i actually picked this up um, when did I pick this up? At SAS? Did I just pick this up? I think I just, yeah, I think I just picked this up at SAS last week, um, for two dollars, I want to say. And it just, it smells like peaches. So I really like how it smells. I don't think it's an exclusively, um, winter scent. Even people in the winter time when this came out were saying that this would be good in, like, the springtime. So very excited to use this. I'm going to put this in my work bag. And then this one is going to go on my nightstand. It's the Burt's Bees um, Honey and Grapeseed Hand Cream. It smells really good. just smells like honey. Um, and it has, like, a really nice thick texture. I got this, um for a present from a friend. And yeah, excited to use this. I'm gonna put it on my bedside table. I'd like to have one there at nighttime and I'll start using it that way. But those two I'll put in the project and hopefully have them used up soon. So that's it for the summer project use it up introduction. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Let me know down below some of the scents that you're looking forward to most using in the summertime. I think for me, it's like coconut cream pie and blackberries and basil, which is kind of a weird odd, odd combination. Um, I don't really have anything left that's like actually a good combo besides like these two. I don't have anything that's like in a full set anymore because um, I've just used up so many different things. And I don't, I'm not really a person that needs to use a set anyways, so it's totally fine by me. Um, but yeah, those two are definitely what I'm looking forward to most using in the summer. So really exciting putting in all these new products to start using. And yeah, I'm just excited to like get this get the ball rolling on the project use it ups and um, get back to using them. And yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did like comment and subscribe down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.